My sister says I can't be in her wedding if I bring my boyfriend of five years. I met my boyfriend in college seven years ago and we started dating five years ago. He is super close and loving with my family. She was there at my niece's births, baptisms, Christmas vacations, etc. We are extremely committed to each other for the long run but don't want to get married until we are financially stable and both our careers are where we want them to be. My sister has been with her fiancé for two years and engaged for six months. My sister is the type of girl who has dreamed of getting married since she was a little girl. It didn't matter who proposed, she just wanted to be married. I have never cared if I got married or not. As long as I have a good career and a happy relationship, I'm fine. In the beginning of her relationship, she tricked me into going on a double date with her fiancé and his brother. She had said it was dinner with her and a friend and it was most definitely not. The brother kept making passes at me the whole time and I told him I had a boyfriend and the whole situation made me uncomfortable. At their engagement party, my boyfriend noticed that the brother wouldn't stop staring at me and we tried our best to avoid him. Every time I have seen this guy he has been weird towards me. But my sister wanted me, my twin for her turn, and two brothers in her wedding. The wedding is supposed to be next month. At the beginning of May, my sister just told me that I was going to be walking down the aisle with her fiancé's brother. I told her that he makes me uncomfortable and I thought I would be walking with my own brother. Apparently, this is something her fiancé is insisting and she wants to make him happy. Seems like a pretty weird thing to insist and I know it's some scheme between the two brothers. My other siblings also thought it was weird and voiced their objections to our sister. She got upset and said this was her wedding and she'd do what she wanted. I told my boyfriend this and he was upset for me. He's confident enough in himself that he knows this guy would never be competition, but he knows how uncomfortable I am with this situation. The other day we had a family dinner at my mom's house. I took this as an opportunity to bring up the situation with my mother around. My sister got extremely upset and started crying saying I was trying to ruin her marriage. I was so confused as was everyone else and tried to explain that he makes me and my boyfriend extremely uncomfortable. She then said that I can't bring my boyfriend to her wedding anymore and if I do, then I'm no longer a bridesmaid. She gave no reason as to why I couldn't bring him and my siblings were just as upset considering they liked my boyfriend a lot better than my sister's fiancé. I thought I would give her a few days to calm down and rethink, but she has not changed her mind. My 19-year-old brother's girlfriend is still invited to the wedding. My boyfriend is an incredible guy and has been nothing but kind and generous to my sister. His feelings are hurt, but he still wants me to go to the wedding. I think my sister is being an unreasonable jerk and I will be pretty pissed off at the wedding if my life partner is not there with me. Being her bridesmaid is something I can live without. So should I bring my boyfriend or go without him? Or should I demand that my boyfriend be allowed to come to her wedding? And that is being super unfair. I love my sister, but I don't understand why she's forcing some silly request by her creepy brother-in-law. I don't know what to do and my family has no help either. Update most of the comments said I shouldn't go to the wedding at all, but she is my sister and I don't want to miss her wedding. I went to my parents' house with my brothers and told them about everything the brother-in-law had done that made me super uncomfortable and how my sister was disrespecting my relationship. My dad was pretty pissed off about the date stunt that she pulled and is on my side. My mom, however, says that I need to try and resolve this with her because if I am not part of the wedding party, people will talk. I honestly couldn't give a crap about what extended family has to say. My mom called a family meeting and told my sister and my twin to come to the house. My dad asked her why I was no longer walking with my brother, to which she responded saying that it's what her fiancé wants and she just wants to make him happy. I pressed the issue, asking why it was such a big deal for me to walk with him and that he's super weird and I wouldn't be surprised if he tried to. Me that really pissed her off. She started crying and yelling, saying a bunch of bull crap how this is all she's ever wanted and we're trying to ruin her special day. Blah blah blah. I was tired of the arguing and just straight up said I'd go to the wedding as a guest. Then I'm leaving. Before the reception. My twin and younger brother took my side and said they don't want to be in the wedding party if I'm not. This made my sister lose her effing mind. She was screaming now, calling me a bunch of names that I couldn't say and also calling my boyfriend names. I decided to leave and let my parents calm her down. But before I could walk out, she ran at me and yanked my hair, still screaming. She wouldn't let go, so I yanked hers too and she let go. She has extensions and apparently, I effed them up and ripped some hair out. She tried to grab me again so I turned the face. I didn't mean at her. It was just my instant reaction to someone coming at me. So now she has a black eye, a cut on her cheek, and missing some hair. She's absolutely livid because her bachelorette party is next week. My mom is mad at me. My dad is not. My sister is now saying that she's going to press charges against me. Can she actually do that or is she just trying to scare me? She's also pissed off because my other siblings won't be in the wedding. She told my mom if I apologized to her and agreed to be at the wedding, she'd let me walk with my brother. I feel like that is bullcrap. She will still make me walk with a brother-in-law last minute. At this point, I feel like it's not worth the trouble and I just don't want to go at all. My mom and dad want me to do what she asked because they're paying for the wedding and want all their kids there. My twin and younger brother said they'll do whatever I want to do, but I don't think I should be the reason they don't go. My boyfriend feels like he started all this drama when none of it is his fault. My sister believes I ruined her wedding. She ruined it herself and I don't know what to do. So the options are to go to the wedding as a guest, be in the wedding, or not go at all. My parents will be upset if I don't go and I really don't want any more tension. But she disrespected me and my relationship. As soon as this wedding is over, I'm going to limit my contact with her for a while.